Allison Parker and With heavy hearts, the morning crew at the CBS station in Roanoke, Virginia, returned to work this morning, minus two members of its team. It's unfair and it's just unimaginable that we're not going to see their smiling faces and hear them laughing. Reporter Allison Parker and photographer Adam Ward were ambushed and killed live on the air Wednesday morning by a disgruntled former employee of their station. I'm gonna that employee was a fellow journalist, Vester Flanagan. He went by the name Bryce Williams while reporting for the station. The 41-year-old was let go two years ago. Andy Parker says his daughter died doing what she loved. It's hard to get your arms around it and, and realize or, or try and make sense of why it happened. Before killing himself, authorities say Flanagan went on a Twitter rant saying Allison made racist comments and Adam complained about him to HR. The general manager here at WDBJ said Flanagan had to be escorted out of the building by police when he was let go. He also called him difficult to work with. In a 23-page document faxed to ABC News, Flanagan apparently described himself as a human powder keg, motivated by the Charleston Church shooting massacre. President Obama called Wednesday's shooting a moment to reflect on. I think it's one more argument for why we need to look at um, you know, how we can reduce gun violence in this country. Prayer vigils are planned in the community in the coming days. Don Champion, CBS News, Roanoke, Virginia.